That's Giggum247.com's extensive coverage of the state 7-on-7 seven -seven tournament. Ran into Vaughn Miller earlier. Ran into my boy J Train, Javorski Lane, rocking his Miami stuff out here, supporting his Lufkin Panthers out here at the 7-on-7 seven -seven tournament. J Train, what you doing out here, man? Oh, man, I'm going to always come to 7-on-7 seven seven to represent Lufkin, man. Uh, you know, it's home of the athletes. If you want an athlete, go to Lufkin and get you one. What is it about those uh, those Lufkin Panthers, man, that's just a, a breeding ground for talent? Oh, man, that's all we do. Football, football, football. You know, that's it. I mean, it ain't nothing else to do in Lufkin. It's, it's just football, football, football. That's it. How good is it be, is, you know, be back in Aggieland? Oh, man, I'm going to always come back to Aggieland. I mean, this this is where J-Train started at. I mean, the Lane Train started in Lufkin, but they, they, they upgraded it to the J-Train. So, I mean, and them treated me good, so I'm going to always come back to College Station. Lots of changes, though, huh? New buildings, lots of, always construction in College Station, and then, you know, a lot of SEC logos around. around. Oh, man, Welburn Road is <laughs> construction heaven right now. <laughs> it's been construction since I reported as a freshman. <laughs> But yeah, like you said, a lot of things, a lot of things done change. The SEC logos, I mean, the whole atmosphere done change. So I mean, I'm loving it. What do you think about that move? You know, I want to get your take on on the Aggies moving. You know, you know, the League of Champions. I mean, you know, it's expected. The first, the first year is gonna be, uh, it's gonna be hard because I mean, they a new team coming in, you know, in a whole different conference. So I mean, I expect it to be hard. But I mean, I like the move. You know, I mean, now you can get the top players in, in Texas, top players anywhere if they want to come, you know, play in the best conference in the world. So, I mean, it's going to be good for them. Well, let's move on to Miami, man. You know, obviously you put in a lot of hard work, get your body right. What, tell everyone and all the Aggie fans what you've been do, what you've been doing to get, you know, get ready and get back into NFL shape. I uh, mean, what I really did, man, I got away from football, man, and I just I focus on my boxing and, and MMA training. You know, that's that's. I heard it to get you in tip-top shape, so that's what I did, man. And I, I got with it. I, I worked with with Ronnie Shields, the who, that who trained Holyfield. I mean, I got with him for the. I've been with him for the past two weeks, right after we got out of the mini camp. So I've been doing that in Houston, and I mean, I'm in the best shape of my life right now. Lots of Aggies there, you know, Mike Sherman or Aggie ties, you know, Coach Turner, obviously Ryan and uh, your Jeff Fuller. You know, you guys kind of get together, you know, have dinners and talk about, you know, your just times at A&M. Oh, yeah, man, we, we see each other every day at practice. I mean, you, you, have, you have former players. I mean, you have Jake Long telling us, damn, we have uh, this, what is this, the Aggie reunion? It was <laughs> hell, it's Aggies everywhere. I mean, you got Dan Campbell also, yeah, the yeah. tight end coach. So, I mean... It, it's, it's, it feel like home to me. Yeah. I want to get your take on, on Ryan Tannehill. You told me we were talking off the camera earlier, you know, just going through those growing pains. But what, are you, what have you seen from, you know, the first Aggies' first-round draft pick this year? Oh, man, Tannehill a genius, man. I mean, Tannehill very smart, very athletic. I mean, of course it's going to take time because you're playing one of the hardest positions in the game, which is quarterbacks. I mean, you have to be the brains of the offense. So, I mean, I mean, he still, every, like you say, everybody just coming in as a rookie, you have a, you know, you have a lot to learn. So, I mean, he's he doing a real good job with it. I think he'll be a great quarterback. Definitely. What have you seen from Jeff? Uh, Jeff showing, you have to see it by Jeff. Now, I'm not, I'm not going to speak on Jeff. Jeff looking real good. That's great. Uh, what, what do you like about Coach Sherman, and obviously the offensive coordinator coming here? What, what do you like about his offense, and where do you see yourself fitting in? Well, what I like about it, they really u utilizing my talent. You know what I mean? Short yard situations, I'm that guy. You know what I mean? At fullback, I mean, I'm in the flats a lot. I'm playing a, outside like a slot tight end, all that. So I'm really excited about it. Thanks. Well, I appreciate the time, Jay Train. Be best of luck to you appreciate in Miami. This is Taylor Ham with GigGum247.com. Appreciate it.